Now, President Museveni's minister has finally confirmed that, yes, it's true, Jacob Olanya was poisoned. And in other news, the Machete Welding Gang, locally known as Bijambia, are back and they have started killing people in Kampala. <laughs> Good morning. Thank you so much for subscribing to the Buzz UG. And in case you haven't subscribed, kindly tap on the subscribe word on your screen and do not forget to tap on the bell for all the notifications. Right now, we are talking 11.1k subscribers. We are growing. I told you our target is 20k subscribers. And you guys, thank you so much for subscribing. Now, you guys, you remember the Machete Welding Gang that killed people in Masaka sub-region? Uh, locally, these guys are known as Bijambia. So, as we speak right now, this gang is back and they have already started terrorizing some parts of Kampala. Uh, last year in Masaka sub-region, over 30 people were killed by these Bijambia guys in just one month. And police came out and said that these guys were sponsored by politicians. That's why we later saw the likes of Honorable Muhammad Segrinya and Alan Sewanyana arrested. And as we speak right now, these guys are still in Chitalia prison. However, this gang is back. And this time around, they are not joking at all. Actually, they have been reported in parts of Nasana. Now, the residents in Nasana are very disappointed in Uganda police because they say that they tried to call police on time, but they came at 9 in the morning. You can imagine. But Uganda police says they have arrested one person so far and they are still hunting for more that they suspect to be part of this machete welding gang. So, so that is it from our parts of Nasana. I think we need to be careful now that these guys are back. But of course, I hope that police is doing all they can to make sure that they calm the situation. Uh, in other news, uh, President Museveni's former minister, that is Godfrey Chiwanda Subi, has revealed that yes, it's true, the former Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Olanya, was poisoned. Now, Chiwanda says last year, Jacob Olanya told him that he had been poisoned. <laughs> However, the Minister of ICT, that is Chris Bariomosi, questioned why Chiwanda is coming out right now after Jacob Olanya died and laid to rest. Now, 
Now, Honorable Semu Junganda, Member of Parliament for Kira Municipality, says Jacob Olanya's father, that is a Nathan Lokori, and Godfrey Chiwanda should be arrested immediately because why did they keep quiet yet they knew that the big man was poisoned? Why? Well, that is Honorable Semu Junganda, Member of Parliament for Kira Municipality. But also, it should be remembered that the spokesperson of police, that is Fred Nanga, came out and said that they are going to arrest everyone who has been talking that Jacob Olanya was poisoned. So that is it. That is the latest news I have on the Buzz UG right now. I don't know what you make of these stories, but the comment section is right there for you. You can actually get to comment. And uh, most importantly, don't forget to subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Thank you.